good morning another session of tau overflows transcendence through actions or how actions can be used as a vehicle for transcendence how actions can be used as a vehicle for transcendence i am not speaking from any religious or scriptural perspective you have to understand what is an action there is something that happens before an action comes into existence that before that precedes an action is emotion emotion can be an emotional disturbance that brings you down or another emotion that can uplift you and emotion arises as an interaction between your heart center your that is kalb and nafs when these interact with consciousness with your mind a thought arises first comes an emotion emotion can be upward can have an upward movement or downward movement that is not important sometimes emotion can be very uplifting other times it will be bringing you down so when it interacts with the process of mind thinking thinking is when consciousness operates through the mind it becomes thinking a thought process and out of that process a thought comes in that this person always brings me down or this person his company his that uplifts me out of that an action will arise you have to transcend beyond those actions that emerge out of the negative emotions or downward movement of the emotions in that category the i had spoken from the scriptural point of view there is bounden duties which we are bound to do, bound to perform on a day to day basis for the sustenance of the body and the mind then there are certain accumulated actions prohibited actions so accumulated actions when you do not dispose of it is like this you have every day garbage coming out as you continue using walking the kitchen has a garbage the garbage in the restroom the toilet papers and things like that some are biodegradable others are not so but we do not sort out for the composition we just put everything there is a battery to be disposed of glass bottles to be disposed of plastic to be disposed of the paper products the food garbage food garbage and paper products are biodegradable whereas plastic and glass is recyclable so in that case there 
every day when we interact into the world, emotion arises. Out of emotion, a certain amount of garbage is collected. Some of the garbage, the emotional garbage, can be used to make the organic fertilizer. Some can be recycled. So this we have to understand first and then it becomes an action. Now anger is an action, is a form of action. Anger is an emotion and it transforms into an action. Greed is an emotion that transforms itself, that becomes action. Violence is an emotion that grows into action. But each emotion grows into a different category of action. Some, as I said, are biodegradable, some are recyclable, but there is a process how you can use it for fertilizer, how you can use for recycling. Then sex is an emotion. Out of sex, all these actions arise. When there is an anger, society creates an anti dote for it. Tells you, or the scriptures, priests, religious community tells you not to get angry. When there is a greed, you should not be greedy. When violence, you should not have violence. Sex, you have to be celibate. This has not served humanity any good. The process remains as it is. The sermons goes on, people listen to these talks, but no result comes out of that. So what is the process of decomposing, the process of Transcendence through actions or actions being transformed is a process. Just as in case of the garbage, you have to sort out the food garbage. In certain countries, the, the garbage company gives you two or three different garbage cans where you have to put your garbage for them to collect. Biodegradable, like food garbage has to be kept separately in a separate bin. The recyclable, where the cardboard paper is can be used as a biodegradable, cardboard can better be used as recycling the glass pieces, plastic. You have to separate. So this process of separation and is requires an understanding. Without that, you cannot separate these. So when it is separated, it can be decomposed, it can be reused, whatever be the purpose, and it is not creating any heap of garbage. In certain countries where this is not the, you know, the all the garbage is dumped at one place. So that is being used at times for the, the filling this ocean. But it has all different types of garbage, broken glass pieces, broken plastic. Pro plastic does not decompose. It remains that is one of the greatest pollution. Glass does not decompose. So there are certain emotions which do not decompose in any way that cause us more damage than anything else. Food garbage, if it is mixed with this, it will, the plastic does not decompose. So these are not reusable. <clears throat> so there are many efforts by the countries to sort out that. But at the individual level, to so sort out inner emotional garbage, we do not have any proper solution. 
you are told to create an anti fool do not get angry because anger is not good do not be greedy because if you are greedy you will not get this you will not get that if you are violent it can harm you it can do this thing all these things but nobody tells you how to decompose these emotional garbage in a creative manner sex there is no way that they can provide you the solution so the sex energy can be transformed into the light so the process to start decomposing these emotional garbage is alertness first then awareness and with awareness meditation comes in there are many meditation techniques you can sit down in a lotus posture when there is anger brewing into you you can play a psalm you can start chanting the su the verses the ayats of quran or sutras of bhagavad gita but that has not done anything if there is a mock in the body it has to be cleaned by using the water soap and other things the you can use um the scrubbers and different things are available for that so when there is an anger you have to understand the cause of the anger behind every anger there is an emotional disturbance when emotional disturbance is an interaction between nafs lower emotions nafs the lower and the other is you are using the um the and when consciousness operates through the mind now you are not operate consciousness is not operating in you directly straight forward you are operating consciousness is operating in you through the filter of the mind and then the you can sit down in a lotus posture and try to compose your body but the mind will be more active because the energy which was distributing between body and mind is not releasing through the body it is going to the mind and through that through the big the battle of the words battle of the hand all these things starts happening so for that one thing you can do as a precaution just as every day you take a shower you take two times a shower you use the body wash you take the soap you have these meditation techniques they wash your body and mind both one of these is that you can sit down in any comfortable position whether it is on the chair or anything your solar plexus is the source of energy it generates energy then it conserves the energy and distributes the energy but it is if it is already um, the uploaded with certain in certain things emotional disturbance and so then you cannot attain it cannot function its normal way because there is corrosion if the battery pole is corroded and it will not generate the electricity the vehicle will not move so you have to clear the corrosion first so for that you can do a simple exercise you have the two palms you put the palms downward facing to the earth the earth that is a gravitational force putting the two hands together keep it by the solar plexus here and from here you are moving outward and you can do this for 15 minutes with the thought that whatsoever is emotional disturbance or garbage or corrosion is accumulated in your solar plexus you are releasing it to the cosmos the in a circular manner and with it intent you can keep your eyes closed and you can feel 
so it will clear that and also it is an exercise for the L, the hands and for the shoulders so when you have done this for 15 minutes then now you have to refill like after you remove the corrosion you use anti-corrosive substance in the battery pool that might be uh, WD-40 or any kind of lubricant that you add so that this corrosion does not happen always. So this lubricant stops the interaction between water and air, the moisture and air that causes the corrosion. Then you keep the palm facing upward. Then now you are filling it from outside. So you are doing the reverse process. From here you are gathering like CD. When there is water on the floor, you are mopping out this way. You take the mop, if you're sitting down and doing with the hand, so you are using this way, the mopping is taking place. You are cleaning the water that has fallen or the liquid that has fallen on the floor. So, but when you are gathering, you are bringing back the energy into you, filling your solar plexus with positive energy from the existence Again, you keep the hands like this. You are, now this is converging. The, in uh, physics, there are two words, converge and concave and convex. So you are converging the energy here. It is coming from the existence and this way, and you are bringing it into the solar plexus. Again, for the same amount of time, 15 minutes, continue doing this. After that, you can sit down with the palms facing upward into one another with eyes closed, not doing anything, just the outcome imbibing the silence within. This technique can be used even by those who are using the healing system, whether it is Reiki, whether it is acupressure, whether it is acupuncture, so they cleanse themselves, fill themselves with the, uh, ec ec the creative energy of the existence. Now they are distributing. If this energy is not there in them, there is anger already. There is not lovingness towards the patient. Then it will become different. But however, if somebody is in communion with an awakened one, this happens naturally and you will mysteriously many things disappear and it becomes difficult to conceive that how this has happened so when anger is arising you are doing this on a regular basis regular basis you are checking your battery poles if there is a slight discomfort or uh, the hitch in starting the vehicle, you check your battery poles, clean it, change the terminals, remove the corrosion using the sandpaper, use the anti-corrosive substance. It not, normally we use a lubricant that is grease that is used in um, the, to keep the, so that the, these are the terms that are used, the substances that are used in mechanical process where there is iron but in the body how are you going to do it in order to cleanse your body you use the body wash or deodorant uh, other things so in meditation when you are going to remove the emotional garbage you have to first every day you have to use this technique so that the corrosion emotional disturbance emotional garbage is not gathered corrosion does not happen if it happens then you know the process the do not try to create antipole first understand it and dispose of meditatively just as you had disposed of your garbage the garbage from the house in a very scientific manner as has been suggested by the 
the authorities in your country, in your vicinity to separate the garbage because it is easy for you to separate the garbage then it would be when all the garbage is collected by the company and if they have to sort out they have to open everything in certain countries for instance in Trinidad there is no such process of the sorting putting the garbage out by sorting it out so it happens that everything goes in the dump and then it does not serve the purpose. In United States and other countries, I noticed that they have kept the separate bins, one for the disposable biodegradable garbage, the other is recyclable garbage, which is the cardboard boxes. The, every time you are buying some item which has a cardboard box, which has a plastic uh, bags, which has the glass bottles, plastic, so all these can be recycled in one way or the other. Plastic is recycled and it is cleaned and after that it is used. Uh, this process of recycling, I can give you an example. Once I was in a cruise, so the, as there was in, uh, events were taking place, the photographers without knowing the commuters were taking the photographs as if they have no restriction or anything there. Just go on click, 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 click. And then they have taken like my about 10 or 12 pictures. So all these pictures, now I am a little crazy person whenever any incident like that, things like that happen, I try to inquire. So then during the break time, they make a display of all these pictures. So the commuters, they go and look at the pictures and whatever pictures they like, they buy it. So, but I saw the pictures, maybe one or two I would have bought. And then remainder of the, um, the tens of the pictures were not used. So I asked the person, so that means this paper that you have used to make the photograph goes into waste. He said, no, nothing goes waste. We clean it and recycle it. So what they did, the photograph, the paper, the photographic paper on which your image is printed, they uh, through the chemical process, which is, I said, how difficult it is. It's a very simple. Once the cruise is finished, the day is finished, Whatever pictures are sold, we sell it, balance whatever is not sold, we clean it and reuse it again. So now this was for my information and anything I gather as information, I try to incorporate into my the messages to the people. You have anger, you can recycle it, you can clean it, the anger will become compassion. Greed will become into another form. Sex will become light. So that is the process. It has to go on. And also you should listen to the, the regular live streaming talk today. The videos of which will be available on YouTube. Where I am going to do in much more detail. This is in a way you can say a short message. For those who do not have time to spend hour or 30 minutes live streaming, something like that, you can call it a bigger reel. So I touch the points of how the actions comes into play and how actions could be transformed and what you can do so that this process of emotional this corrosion does not happen. So that meditation and this is good for those people. And then another thing which is very good, that is humming. You are creating the humming. So humming. Humming creates a connection between your nasal and your solar plexus. When you are humming, the hammering happens in that in a rhythmic manner. 
So every morning you can't do anything, but you do many other things to stand in front of the mirror to see that this wrinkle and that wrinkle and you use this black spot, the cream and that. Do something for your inner body. Do for your innerness. Do humming. Do this exercise, this meditation. Humming is a very important message like the bees, they hum. And that humming is a very, it can be a musical repertoire. So you are doing the and anything that you can do, you can start with five minutes and it is not necessary that you do any in the morning or evening, any time that is possible. You are sitting in the office, you can do this. You are sitting in the office, you are driving, you can do this cannot be done while you are driving, but humming you can do. You can create various, many variations as the energy begins to flow. The, as you are cleaning up the emotional disturbance, sometimes the water that has been collected somewhere and you are removing it from that area. So the, you are pushing, sweeping it out. So somewhere it is more, somewhere it is less. So you can do sometimes the, the humming in a different manner. We naturally do these sounds. So if you observe every body does this sound naturally, whenever there is kind of emotional disturbance and feel relaxed. So we can use these, try to see what it does and does it not relax afterwards to you? So if it does, then simple technique can be used as a uh, the a deodorant, uh, as a um, the soap or body wash or the inner wash. So only this much for this morning. We will come back for tomorrow for another session until it is feasibly feasible for us. So take care and do have a pleasant day.